Dun, 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 dun. All right, we're live. I mean, dun, not live. Dun, we're, dun, we're, dun, dun. we're in the movie. Bye. Uh, yeah. No intro. Yeah, no we don't have an intro. intro. Yeah. Anyway, okay. <clears throat> you wanna start? Yeah, I'm gonna start by saying that animals. Uh, I hate animals. This is all like dirty. Hold, I'm not gonna drink this. Why do you hate animals? I don't know. Sorry. Got something against animals? We're animals, yeah. you know. No, we're you mammals. You hate yourself then. Mammals. Here, just drink your soda and talk. Talk about what we're gonna do. Actually, it's all dirty. I'm going to drink soda. I'm going to have chips up. That's really weird. So, anyway, uh, sorry. <laughs> we went to see the other guys tonight. Yes. Yeah. We, we've been, uh, uh, just ate, so I'm going to be burping a lot. Um, yeah, we're eating right now. We, uh, we've been looking forward to this movie because uh, we're both Feral fans, you know? And he wants to make as much noise as possible while I am talking, you know? We're both Feral fans, you know? Um, so we, we've been looking forward to this movie, um, you know? Yeah. And we went to see it. Yeah. And, and uh, uh <laughs> who should go first? Okay, okay, I'll say, okay. so we got other thoughts on it. Um, yeah. see, I'll, I guess we'll have the, uh, I'll just give a general overview. This is the non-spoiler portion of this review. Um, and then we'll talk about more details maybe later. Yeah. Um, but I thought it was, like, an okay, an average comedy. Like, uh, like, it made me laugh and and all that and it uh, it was good but I thought it was average like it wasn't like the pow- a powerhouse comedy like some of the Will Ferrell's past movies or um, or you know some really yeah. good comedies like Forty Year Old Virgin or something which is or it was, like really hard those are really good comedies um, it felt that the reason why I say this is um, because it fell short in a few areas and. First, first area I think is um, we kind of talked about this on the car ride, but the uh, the jokes are kind of hit and miss. Mm-hmm. Um, and there's like a lot of jokes. Yeah. Like a lot. Like the whole movie is like jokes, like trying. You know what I mean? Yeah. So. And and it's kind of hit and miss. Like I mean, there was a lot of good hits, and there was some misses where I was like, that was that joke. <laughs> Yeah. Like, I was like, okay. Where you kind of you kind of got that it was supposed to yeah, like be funny, but you're like, it's not really funny. Yeah, you're just like, yeah. uh, you know. Um, but there were a lot of funny jokes too. Um, yep. But also, I think in terms of my understanding, and I'm thinking you too. Like uh, the plot, I think is where this movie. And I know I'm talking about the plot in a comedy, movie, but it's important because it drives the movie yeah. forward. Like, yeah, it's the driving force and they never make it make sense. Yeah, yeah, the so plot not... doesn't make sense at all. Like, they, I mean, they, they, they talk about, like, key plot elements, like, once, it, like, brings up once, and they're like, oh, this is it, and then they move on to the next, and you're just like, what, what? Yeah. what? And, like, and it's all about, like, this corporate executive stuff that's just like, what? Yeah. And, and um, I mean, like, like I said, it doesn't interfere with the jokes. Like, that's the thing. The jokes have almost nothing to do with the plot. Yeah, which, exactly. For better or worse, you yeah. know, it's like it's good because it, you, that way you don't have to pay attention to the plot. Exactly. But it's bad because then you're like, what, what the hell? Like, so what's happening? Yeah, you're like, what's going on? And then they they like keep drive talking about the plot, and they're like, okay, we gotta do this, and they go do the plot, and they're like, it's like, I mean, at, at that point, I'm just like, what is going on? Like, oh my god! And so, um, so yeah, and uh, that is basically all I can say about yeah. without spoiling. Things. And I just want to say, so yeah, it's like an average comedy. Um, honestly, I don't think I can recommend paying full price for a movie ticket. Just thank you for getting in the way. Sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, I don't have any water shit. <laughs> sorry. You're going to have to just go without it for now. I know. Alright. I don't think I can recommend seeing this movie for full price because it's, I mean, it's like I said, it's average. I think maybe it feels like 7 or $6 for seeing a movie. I might recommend it just for some fun. Yeah. But, uh, it's not like the powerhouse comedy that yeah. I thought it would be. So, uh, that's my non-spoiler section of the review. What's, what are your thoughts? Well, my non-spoiler section of the review would be like, I kind of brought this up in the car too, is that if you, uh, we were talking about Will Ferrell, and I was like, for him, he likes Will Ferrell too, but for him, some of the stuff, like, I'm a Will Ferrell diehard fan, which I know makes me like an instant douchebag if you guys are going to hate me. For some reason, I just love Will Ferrell, like, in everything he's in, like, I just like I'm like, drawn. No what? <laughs> exactly. Like I'm like a fucking fly to like a like a cow shit pancake. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm a Will Ferrell right? fan too, but he's like more so. Yeah, because like even if he's like that ah, was okay, it wasn't really that great. I'm like, dude, it's Will Ferrell. He's hilarious. Like, what well, example would be Step Brothers? Yeah. Like he was like, oh, it was all right, well, whatever. Like, yeah. and I'm like, no, it's hilarious. But 
The thing is, is if, if you don't like Will Ferrell, this movie's gonna fall completely on its ass. Because Will Ferrell, it's he's still being Will Ferrell. And yeah, so, yeah, yeah. He has like, some good Will Ferrell moments. Yeah, yeah, I mean, and there's not a whole lot that doesn't rely on him. You know what I mean? In the movie, like it's him, like the comedy. And so, like, I mean, there's other stuff. There's like funny setups, but most of the time, when like someone says something funny, it's like thanks to Will Ferrell. But at the same time, if you don't like his style of comedy, then you're gonna be like, what? You know, yeah. like why? Like I don't get it. Or like you know, that's stupid yeah. or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, other than that, like, it basically, yeah, it's, it's, like he said too, it's PG-13, and for a PG-13 comedy, it's about par for course, that, like, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Like, it does, there's, like, a competent car chase, there's a competent, well, kind of gay shootout, like, I mean, you know, it was, yeah. it wasn't, it wasn't great, it was, I, I would call it, like, just barely... Like, yeah, there, they, there were some scenes where they are trying to be an action movie, yeah. and it didn't really work, it yeah. was just, like, kind of like a really subpar action movie and it's like they're trying to be funny with it but it's just kind of like yeah cause instantly in my head when I was doing action movie things like going for the tropes I was instantly comparing it to Pineapple Express yeah which which, which did it really good yeah. yeah but anyway if that's all you have for the non-spoiler section why don't we move on to um, talking about the actual details alright yeah let's get into nitty gritty alright spoilers spoilers for a comedy movie yeah <laughs> uh oh whoa Uh-oh, plot look out. um anyway so uh so so I'll I'll, uh, I'll talk about the two big problems I had with this movie, the plot, and and also I didn't bring this up, but the ending, um, not the ending, but the credits. I'm, I have a something I want to say. It's kind of weird. Um, the plot, like I said, is very confusing, very weird. It's like I actually still don't even know what it was about. Like I I, I don't know what the plot was about. So for some like apparently there was this corporate executive guy who like got money and then he owes people money and then he's getting money from something I don't know what he's getting it from mm-hmm. he's gonna give it to those people but I don't know how it's going on like this and then they're like then Will Ferrell and they're all like we gotta stuff this and then they do stuff and and yeah. then it ends and I, I, I don't think that's it like really I'm just like uh, yeah I was what? like stop what yeah and so like the plot I'm just like I don't get it like I, I was just like completely lost yeah um, and the other thing that I kind of had a problem with was the ending credits. Um, and now I know you're like, ending credits, what? But they did this weird thing about the ending credits where they kind of like did this kind of like, um, what is it, like a social commentary? Yeah. On, uh, like, what they basically what they did was they, during the credits, they had these like statistics showing like, like, uh, these CEOs make they, this much money yeah. in 1920, now they're making this much money, and that's like 40 billion yeah. times more than you. And this bailout money, it's like, like divided in Americans, will give them $3,000 and, and blah, 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 and CEOs got a bonus. And like, it's like, okay, I really, I don't like disagree with that stuff. I mean, I, you know, I'm not going to get into political stuff on this, but like, it's not like, I'm not saying like, they don't have any right to say things like that. It's like, you know, I don't disagree or I'm not arguing against those statements. I'm just arguing against the re- like yeah, the placement. reason, the placement and yeah, reason like, for putting it in there. Yeah. Like there was nothing in the movie that at all suggested these comments that were on the credits. I was like, what? Like when I saw them, I was like, what are they talking about? Like, are they really just gonna bring this up? Like, it was really out of place. Yeah. Like when I saw it, I was just like, what? Like. That was completely out of the left field. I was like, "Why are they talking about this?" Like, it, uh, it, it was, was friggin' almost. It was almost just like copy pasta. Like at the last minute, he's yeah. like, "Oh, I found this." It was like as if the director like was like, "I'm gonna make a comedy movie, and I'm also gonna like make a social statement." Yeah, and I yeah. was like, "Like, in, in a comedy movie? Like, really? I mean, and like, and, and if you would have put it in the movie, like as like sarcastic, kind of like, like kind of clever, you know, like whatever, yeah, yeah. like that would be cool because it would have been like you know." an ironic, clever social commentary, yeah. like, you know, it would have been funny, it would have been more acceptable in terms of the situation, yeah. but it was, like, literally just, like, <laughs> like, and if it was supposed to have something to do with the plot, the plot was so yeah. dumb and confusing, like, it just, like, whoosh, yeah, just, so, no, it didn't get that, yeah. Yeah, it was just, like, <laughs> goes like, uh, like, bye. Yeah. Like, I <laughs> mean, took off, yeah. so those are my big problems, and, again, it's, like, you know, so you're, like, you're arguing about plot in a comedy movie, yeah. wait, what's the time on that, I just realized, uh uh-huh. Let me check. Hold up. We got like a minute. Okay. Um, we can just... How we just tap out? Okay. So, be right back. Just one second. 